how did you get to become an actor, I guess? Uh, so when I was young, as I said before, um, I, my, my therapist encouraged me to get into acting so that I can mimic other people's behaviors to try to fit in a little bit better. The bullying was relentless and I just wanted to either die or um, to just be normal, quote unquote. And so she said, well, then the only way that you can be normal is by fitting in and maybe if you don't feel the feelings, maybe you can fake like you do. So I got into community theater and, I mean, therapy was the first thing, and then I got into community theater. Um, and so I just learned, you know, I really, you know, I, uh, autistics get hyper-focused. Um, and so I got hyper-focused on learning everything about acting, studying the greats. I would watch film actors and, and, and replicate their face behavior, uh, facial uh, reactions. And I try to, watch movies and pick pick out mannerisms and like oh that person i think that's happy that i saw and then the reaction is happy and oh wait i was wrong no they're very mad okay that's why they're mad um and then i just became uh an expert at uh, replicating those behaviors yeah Here, let me make eye contact with you i hate making eye contact with people nope <laughs> That's the hardest part about acting is connecting with your reader. I don't need I could I could I could give the most beautiful heartfelt gut-wrenching rendition of an emotional scene charged behind a man and a wife where the wife has cheated on her husband and she's threatening to take the children but he just lost his mom and there's also a tornado coming. I I can I can intellectualize all of that and deliver a line to a ping pong ball does not matter. Actors need other people to work off of. Like, I don't, I don't need that. 